day two in Kyoto and we're now at the Imperial Palace which was basically where the Imperial family, the Emperor, used to live until 1869. We're in the Meiji Restoration, so the old capital used to be in Kyoto and then in 1869 it moved to uh, Tokyo. So this is basically where the old Emperor's Imperial family used to live. Yes! <laughs> Dilly's very hot today. She's uh, looking very Japanese, aren't you? I have nothing to say. <laughs> <laughs> Let's explore the palace. This is the Great Hall, which I don't think we're allowed in. That's the Great Hall, the Banquet Hall. Oh, how do you know that? I said it outside. Oh. So either it doesn't say, or I'm not reading it. Usually one of the two. All these strong wooden buildings you see are made out of cypress tree. Ah. Cypress tree? Cypress. Cypress tree. Um, which is obviously very, very strong wood. I know, but we just that's saying, I can't believe it lasts so long. Yeah, which is how it's able to kind of be in such good condition for hundreds of years. Look at this building. The Hall of the Sacred Mirror. It sounds like something out of Harry Potter. Like the Mirror of Erised. Oh, yeah. We start going to Harry Potter no, mode again. Not again. The living quarters of the emperor. The Seriodon. Japanese water gardens are just too epic. They're so peaceful, aren't they? They are. Ancient Japanese football, pure possession, no goals. Legendary. Arigato. Somehow we got forced to come in here. Yeah, we got tricked inside, didn't we? Tilly needs her coffee or she doesn't function well in the day. Is it good? Is it not good? You don't like you're too happy with it. What's wrong with it? I balls. What have you ordered? Let me try some. It's, Co it's Coca Cola, Ed. It's Coca Cola with milk. Nothing special, is it? It's not awful, though. It's not awful. So how relaxing are these Japanese tea rooms? Like, I know. Look at this music. It's just the like, music is nice. I could just go to bed on the floor. Such a nice vibe. Bed on the floor. Oh, we're back on our favourite. Okay. Quarter bikes. Unlock. We got a short seven-kilometer journey to our next destination, which might be the most famous place in Kyoto. Unlocked. There you go. You're a natural. I'm getting better at it. Hopefully it'll be a nice scenic ride. There's a, there's a huge spider web here. No one, clearly no one really uses these. Only we're crazy enough to do this. Okay, I'm ready. Right, let's go. We've got our route. 25 minutes in a car, so 40 minutes and for us probably. Oh you good? What happened? It's like to run forward, I can't stop. We're gonna die. These river systems have got to be my favourite thing about Kyoto. I think it's just so, so peaceful down here. Everyone's sitting on the bank, fishing, having some food. What day is it? Friday? Yes. It's so nice down here, isn't it? It's so nice. All these lovely wooden buildings. It's really hard work, guys. It's really hot. I think we might have arrived, judging by these crowds. Another day, another sushi picnic in the car park. We've left our bikes and we've left the touristy area to have some lunch. We got veg sushi, we got tuna, we got salmon. We got these weird, weird chicken, chicken rice balls. So I don't really know what they are. But they're cheap. A bucket of soy and then ginger, wasabi. And all of this in our favorite supermarket life cost about 10 pounds. Yeah. Not I also bad. got a Coke as well. Not I betrayed too bad. myself. This probably won't be the last time you see us do this in Japan. <laughs> We're gonna eat all of this now before we head to the very special mm. shrine. Good? 
Also, everyone's coming in and out of the supermarket. There's actually no one there right now, but oh, there we go. They look like when, when they're like, what the hell are these? They're like, what are these absolute sushi crack fiends doing in the corner of the car park? Here we are. Fushimi Inari. Which translates in Japanese to tourist hellhole. <laughs> that was quite funny. You like that one? Yeah. Wow. Alright, we made it to the entrance now. Look at this. We've navigated our way through the crowds, and to be fair, this is pretty impressive. I love the colours. I no animals here, sorry, you're gonna have to turn around. Oh, that is a good one. So, this is the most important. Inari Shrine, which is the god of rice in Japan. In Japan, the most important shrine for the god of rice. <laughs> Wasn't the best worded sentence ever, but we're gonna go with it. Um, the god of rice. The god of rice. Wow, there's millions of them. Aren't there? There are. Millions of gates for millions of tourists. It's nice with the sunlight. Well, no, it's nice, isn't it? So this path of Tori Gates leads to Mount Anari and the sacred forest below it. Pit stop. Whole lot of gates. So Inari is the Shinto god of rice and foxes are her messengers. That's why you see a lot of fox statues around here. And foxes in real life. And foxes in real life. They have foxes in Japan. They do, don't yeah. they? Yeah. Um, they I think they're, they're a bit nicer than the foxes we see in London. They're probably like wild. I mean, all foxes are wild, but you know, like proper nice ones. Yeah, soft, nice ones that live in the woods and don't live out of bins. It's getting steep now. Time for you to take the bag again. Yeah, probably. It's in our best interests. We were not expecting this. Well, I wasn't. I bet Eddie Seat really was. I don't think it'll be this long. I don't know how many gates we've gone through. I think there's like more than 10,000 in total. Really? Something like that. Oh, 20 minutes to go. I'm gonna see these gates in my dreams tonight. It does feel a bit like weird, doesn't it? It's trippy. It's a bit like Mario Kart. It's like a Mario it Kart. It is, it's like that track. Mario Kart game in uh, Universal. To be fair, this would make a good Mario Kart track. It would. Nintendo, if you're watching this, make it happen. Are these foxes with their little bibs on. What's in their mouth? I don't know, like a bit of wood. God, it's quite creepy around here now. It's getting dark, isn't Lots it? Lots of big spiders in huge webs. I think we're nearly here. Oh gosh. Every time I think that, I just see more. More and more orange. But this girl ahead of us is wearing heels like this big. I mean, nutter. Well, we're not in shorts. Oh God. Well, I'm in thick trousers. I think this is it, Ed. Come on. This the top. Is this the top? Yeah. We made it. I'm really hot. That was good though. You got a coin? No. Oh, it may be in my bag. Yeah, I thought I had every bag we owned. Huh? I'm slightly disappointed there's no view. Yeah. But we made it, that's the important it's one thing. Of those side pockets. Because this place is special, I'm gonna give them a 50. Head. <laughs> Eddie. 
bed. I can't believe you even fifty. We're walking about the hill for it. Well, yeah, we, they should be paying us. They can't give us their. They would be just there. Like, I look nice. They should be paying us. Oh, this is so cool. My usual one. Look at this. Shrine within a shrine within a shrine. I see why this place is so special now. And now we go all the way back down. It's a wild Japanese cat. I doubt they're wild. Another one, look. Mm. Oh, sorry. sorry. Good cat. We've made it to the bottom. What did you make of that? You know what? I actually, once I was said to myself, this is a 40 minute climb, I have to get over it, I was okay. I just wasn't expecting it at all. I thought when we went up the first gate and came back, that was it. Mm. And then it was like, this is 40 minute climb. And I was like, Ooh. Yeah, was I, was, really I, was, nice. I was a bit worried when we got in that like, there were so many tourists out at the bottom. I was like, Eddie oh. was literally running. I was like, like is this going to be another bamboo forest? But it was really actually like peaceful and nice once you got high up the mountain yeah. and kept walking. It was, yeah, really good. We teleported from the shrine to the center of Kyoto, where we're now going to get some dinner and go to bed. We're not going to take you to dinner with us. <laughs> um, so that ends this video. Our time in Kyoto. Is over. Dun dun dun. It's over. Um, we might swing back here at some point. Mm. We'll see because I feel like there is still more stuff we need to do. There's but... so much to do. It's quite overwhelming. Like when you look at what to do, there are so many shrines, so many temples. Yeah. And we haven't really figured it out yet. So yeah, we might come back. Yeah, some of them are going to be like really amazing that we missed out on. So maybe we'll come back, maybe not. Um, it's been a good time here anyway. Uh, my highlight, I don't know, it's between the temple and the many Tory gated shrine today. I I'll probably give it to yeah. the Tory gated. This it was a really? bit really. This was a bit longer. The temple was quite quick, wasn't it? Oh, mine's definitely going to um, the, the Golden Temple thing. Yeah, fair. I really like that as well. Um, anyway, we're gonna get food, go to bed. Uh, so, thanks for watching. Drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Peace.